so uh, <laughs> a little bit overdue. Um, basically, this this episode is way too far. Hold on, I gotta make sure this is focused. There we go. Um, I didn't make a view, an episode for this Daily Dylan series for a couple days, um, mainly just for the sole reason that I was busy with work and I had a party yesterday with my friends. Um, and the other day I just didn't really, I mean, I know it's Daily Dylan series, but I, I, I don't know, I didn't really feel good to make one. And uh, I don't know, it's just been a lot of heavy feelings on me lately. And uh, I don't want any of you guys to feel bad or whatever. It's life you go through feelings with, you know, events and people and other things and I don't know. Anyways, I might have to cut this uh, episode just because, or not like cut it, but like pause it for a second because my mom's coming home and my dog is really loud so you can barely hear anything except for that bark. So it get, really gets really disruptive. But today uh, I want to talk less about life lessons and more about a personal issue that I have with myself, and that's my fears, because a lot of my fears, uh, and I don't, I'm not really, I don't really, wouldn't really characterize it as anxiety, and more just like things that stop me from doing stuff. And if you want to call it anxiety, do what you want, but I don't really think it is. Um, not that having anxiety is bad. It's obviously, it's anxiety. It's not a good feeling. And I'm not trying to gain a sympathy vote or something like that. I just, this, these are just things that I'm scared of myself. Uh, the first one is being lonely. Um, I'm, I'm an extrovert. I'd like, at least I'd like to consider myself one. So I'm always, you know, engaging with other people. I feed off of other people's energy. And I really enjoy just being in the company of somebody else. Um, mostly my friends. I don't really like, you know, being with people. I don't like, I don't think anybody else does. But family, friends, family, friends, uh, loved ones, those are the people I like to be around, feed off their energy. Um, that's just how I am. And I just like to, I, I don't know, it's just something weird with my brain, the chemicals, I just like being around other people, and that's what makes me tick. So that's one thing I'm really scared of, is being lonely and not having someone there for me. And, you know, even in moments where I know that someone's there for me in the sense that they would like to talk to me if they can, but they're like asleep or gone, I'm just always scared of, you know, those couple of hours or whatever that I'm always just like by myself. Um, the next one is called drowning and, sorry, figuratively and literally. Literally, I'm scared of being, or drowning in the ocean. That's probably one of my scary, scariest things that I've ever uh, had dreams about is drowning in water. And I just, the, the, the thought of like not being able to breathe and just suffocating is really scary to me. Um, and the second one, uh, second, second really meaning is drowning is in just getting in so much pressure in your life that you just feel like you're slowly having stuff toppled on top of you and you just don't have any way of getting out and you just feel like you're suffocating in that way. And I just have that fear because I'm just scared. I'm just scared that um, I'm not going to have sort of any way to like I'm gonna get in that situation and I don't know I'm not gonna know yeah I'm not gonna know what to do so drowning is not good um, obviously um, next one's debt um, not only money debt but debt to other people uh, feeling like I owe them something like that obviously that feeling is bad and not good but just the feeling of the feeling of owing somebody something because you did something wrong or like you you didn't keep up your word or something like that that just really holds on me and the fear of actually having that, having that sort of, like having a feeling of debt, like feeling that you owe somebody something or you owe something is not a good feeling, especially when you do and you know it. So that's bad. Um, and that's what I'm really scared of. Uh, next one's lying. And lying is one thing I've done a few times before to people that I really care about and to people that I don't, you know, it, it goes both ways. Um, and lying is just terrible because I like to be honest with everybody, and this kind of ties with the next one, which is dishonesty. But the next the next one's a little different. But lying for me is like when you don't tell when when I tell somebody something wrong, or I tell someone something, and I save them details, or save them the whole truth, that because I think it will make them feel better. But don't, but you think about it, if you don't tell someone the whole truth, there's really no point in telling them the half truth either, because they're still not getting the same the right information, and one way or another, they're still going to get hurt. So it it just doesn't. For me, being lying is bad, and I do it sometimes, um, or I have done it before, and it doesn't feel good to do. Like it doesn't. I don't think anybody really likes lying, unless 
like you're a cynic or something like that and you do but that's just yeah that's just who it is but next one is dishonesty and that's more just people being dishonest with me and not telling me the whole truth and i don't like that i'm scared of people not telling me the whole, the whole truth and not you know talking to me and telling me what's going on and keeping me out of the loop and not being 100% with me in, in, in that way. And just dishonesty just sucks because you know that, you know, it is not that hard to put in that much effort just to keep like on the same loop and the same wavelength. So being dishonest really feels cruddy and, it, and I'm, scared, I'm scared that it, like when it, when, it, when it happens. So there's that. And there's also the fear of, yeah, there goes my dog. There's the fear of being fake. And the fear of being, the fear of being somebody that I'm not, and telling somebody or, or or of interacting with somebody that you know that you know is fake. So, those are my fears, my my, my central fears. I hope you guys will watch like like, like watching this video. Um, leave a like down below if you want. Leave a dislike down below if you also want to. Subscribe for more daily Dylan's, and I will see you guys tomorrow, hopefully. See ya.